What's going on everyone? Thanks so much for joining me today. This is video 4 in the series covering AR magazines. Now, previous videos I've stated that there are different types. You have steel, polymer, and aluminum. This video we're going over the pros and cons of aluminum. Some of the pros are they're extremely lightweight and durable, especially with the anti-tilt followers, very reliable feeding. Uh, I will go over anti-tilt followers in a later video. Also, they are not as susceptible to breaking down over time, uh, being exposed to extreme heat and UV, unlike polymers. And they also do not become as brittle in extreme cold, unlike polymers. One of the downsides of these magazines, if they take an impact, uh, they can become um, inoperable due to dent in the magazines. Unlike polymer, polymer tends to take an impact and bounce off. Um, so in a way they are more durable but they can they also can't take as much of an impact especially to the side like a polymer magazine but really good option these magazines are made by OK Industry a very long proven track record of really good reliability and durability uh, this is their latest generation um, with their texturing right there and their own designed anti-tilt followers Next magazine up is made by DNH Magazines. Uh, this is actually formerly known as LaBelle, but they make really excellent magazines. Now, this is a Colt marked magazine, and if you look at the cage code 33710, 33710, okay, industry actually makes. Colt magazines. Now this is a NHMTG marked magazine made in Hartford, Connecticut. This is uh, essentially a Colt magazine made by OK Industries. And this is another NHMTG 20 round magazine also made by OK Industries. Really excellent magazines. Uh, just make sure that uh, you keep track of them uh, and you take care of their magazine and you take care of your magazines and they will be extremely reliable and last a very long time all right i hope this information helps thanks so much for joining me today make sure you like subscribe bed get share i'll see you on the next one i'm out